So I want to share something that I found this year that I absolutely love. It is called micro spikes. I'm going to show you how to use them and I'm going to tell you why they are so great. A couple of years ago, I had a shoulder injury and so I skipped a season of skiing. And what I started doing instead was hiking and winter hiking you can do with skins and some skis or you can do uh, snowshoes, you can do cross country skiing, which you still have the, the possibility that you're gonna fall on your shoulder. So what I ended up doing was hiking and I discovered these things. Micro spikes by, I don't know how you pronounce it, but I'm gonna guess. Tula. So what I'm going to do is show you how to use these because I have found them so useful and so helpful. So first I use them every time I go hiking. Any sort of trail, even if you have massive snow, sometimes you have leaves underneath where you slip and you fall and you sort of scramble your way up and out. And especially when you're on your way down. Um, I've had multiple instances where my feet swoop out from under me and I land on my tailbone or my back and it doesn't feel good. So um, in hopes that I'll help people not get injured, um, I wanted to just show you how these things work, what they are. Um, so you pull them out of the little handy dandy package where it easily fits both, both of the spikes. Okay. And they sort of look like little torture devices, but they're not. Um, only for your shoes. So the, this bag is awesome because it's um, probably nylon and it dries really quickly. So if you're out in the snow, they're wet or out in the rain, whatever, you throw them in the bag, they dry, there's no sort of mold buildup or anything weird. So number one, great bag, nice feature. All right, so secondly, uh, these are pink ones. I've also seen black. I've also seen sort of a deeper red color. They come in four sizes. They're small, medium, large, and extra large. I have a size medium and I have, my shoe is a 10 women's. Um, I think that a, if you need a small, if you're a women's size five to seven, um, and then I could even go with the large. I've used a large on my boots and those are also fine. But um, check with the sizing because if you have, I've seen somebody who tried a large and they really needed a small and these things just hang and they don't function properly. So um, I just wanna show you the little spikes on there. They're pretty little and they look very insignificant when you're looking at them that way, but they work like a champ. So I'm gonna put them on so you can see how they, how they fit. Um, I have my handy dandy boots, which I love. These things are Canadian boots, Pajar, Pajar, I don't know how you pronounce them. But so um, there's a front and a back. The back has a little pull tab um, and this one has the sizing written on it. So if you get in there, it says medium with a little pull tab, that's the back, okay? And the front looks like it would go around the front of the boot, so a little three thing. So what we're gonna do here is put the front around the boot like so, and then take the bottom and just pull it up and over like a sock. And it's honestly that simple and easy. So when you have them on your boot, they should be tight, right? There's no dangling or no hanging. You can't hear the chains moving, but you see how they, the spikes literally stick out. And now they look less insignificant. Now they look very significant, don't they? So, um, but when you're walking up and down these things, they, you're, when I first tried them, I thought, are they really gonna work? But they are rock stars. They are champs. I dare you to not like them. So there's 70 bucks. You can buy them pretty much at any store, REI or um, Amazon or wherever. And um, I highly recommend them. I also use them walking on flat surfaces when I have any sort of ice. Um, so if you're going walking on the streets after an ice storm or after a snowstorm, you can walk and not slip. 
these things are awesome. I highly recommend them. So just wanted to put this out there um, in, in case you're looking for a new outdoor gear item to collect or if you want to do some winter hiking um, and not fall on your butt. So anyway, thanks for watching. And uh, hey, go visit the Wellness Groove if you are interested in working out, learning more about wellness and your body, healthy eating tips, chakras, you name it. So head on over there, take a look at that and also hit the subscribe button if you liked what you saw and you wanna get more of this in your feed. So thanks for watching, see you next time.